Hey guys, it's Rosie. Welcome back. Today I'm going to be talking about my um, summer bucket list for this year and comparing it to last year's, which is basically what I talked about in my latest podcast episode if you want to check that out. But I'm going to uh, do a very abbreviated version here um, along with a bunch of pictures from what I did last year. So if you hear any weird noises, that is my chickens. Just ignore it. Um, here's my old bullet journal. Um, I'm going to find the page. Here it is. So. Here's the page that I made last year, and I did over two-thirds of them, I think. So that was pretty good, because I set some pretty ambitious ones. So I'm just going to read through what I did, and then I'm going to show you guys what I am going to do this year, or try to do at least. So I wanted to, like, highlight my hair or something. I never ended up doing that, except, like, with the sun. Um, I wanted to go to a concert, and I actually went to two. I went to a Jason Mraz concert and a Shawn Mendes concert. Um which there are videos of both of those, so you should check those out. I also wanted to make a Polaroid wall, which I did, and it's in my room, as you have probably seen. Um, and there is a video about that one, if you want to check that out. I wanted to go stargazing, um, have a spa day, sleep on the trampoline, have a photo shoot in the field of flowers, and that one um, there is a video about. And of course, all of these I have done. Then I painted on jeans, used a film camera, and visited an amusement park. There was a video about me um, painting on my jeans. Um, I went to learn the guitar, uh, make a summer scrapbook, and write a letter to my future self, which I did not do. Um, I did learn the guitar, though, so I did um, postpone some of these also. I wanted to try a celebrity workout and go cliff jumping, like into the water, of course. Um, and I did try a celebrity workout. I did the Chloe Ting 30-day like shred I guess it's called in last June. I also wanted to horseback ride on the beach which I didn't get to that one but hopefully someday I'll get to that because that's kind of on my like ultimate bucket, li bucket list. I wanted to use my passport but we didn't end up leaving the country last summer so that's okay because we left the country later on in the year. Also spend a night at the beach which was Puerto Rico and we went there in August so there is a video about that I I think there's a video about that. Yeah, pretty sure. I also wanted to give back to the community and I count my Girl Scout Silver Award project as that, um, which is my book, Get Outdoors. So if you want to buy one of those, you should definitely buy one. It is The link is in the description where it's on Barnes & Noble, or you can go to getoutdoorsbook.com. I also wanted to go sailing, meet somebody new, and travel somewhere new, and I actually never got to those three but I postponed travel somewhere new to this year. Hopefully we'll be able to go somewhere new. Um, build a fort and sleep in it. Go to the beach and go paddle boarding. So I have a video about building a, board, a fort and sleeping in it, which was super fun. Um, you should definitely check that one out. Um, go to the beach, of course, I, I did a video about that one, but that was just Puerto Rico. Also going paddle boarding. Um, I did that a lot, I did that once a week. Also, watch fireworks. I postponed that one till September, which I still count as summer, even though I was already in school. Um, watch the sunrise, um, go thrift shopping, and take a road trip. I did all of those. Um, the road trip one was going to Indiana, so I have a video about that one. Take pictures at a waterfall, which I didn't end up getting to do, but I'm postponing that one to this year. Also, have a picnic, um, work out every day. So I did both of those. Um, there is no video for those, but those were fun. Also, Shawn Mendes concert. That was one of the concerts. And like I said, there is a video about that one if you want to check it out. Also, tie-dye something. Um, I tie-dyed a shirt for my volleyball team. So, all right, that is it for last year. Now let's move on to what we have for this year. I just made this page yesterday. So here's what it looks like. And of course, I'm only like halfway Full. so if you have any ideas definitely comment them because I am very open to suggestions I separated um, the ones that I think are going to be possible from the ones that I'm not sure are going to be possible because of coronavirus so I'm gonna read you guys all the ones that I think are possible and then later um, the ones that aren't and I might not even write those ones down so I want to take pictures at a waterfall um, cut my hair, which is actually happening next week. I'm super excited. Have a bonfire with friends, um, or not with friends, depending on if that can happen. That one's kind of not possible, but we'll see. Go to a drive-in movie. 
um, dance in the rain, late night swimming, um, chalk the driveway, city day, play sand volleyball, make a summer scrapbook, travel somewhere new, go to the beach, watch the sunrise or sunset, um, have an electronic free weekend with only music, um, go thrift shopping, go on a road trip, and write a song. So all of those I will try my best to complete and also um, try to get those onto my summer bucket list um, playlist on my channel. So make sure you check back um, every Tuesday and Saturday for my videos. But of course, some of them might be summer bucket list videos coming up very soon. I think I'm counting June as the start of summer, even though got a bit into June before summer starts. So just a few more weeks and um, we will be able to start this series. So the ones that are not so reasonable are um, going to an amusement park, um, seeing some live music, going surfing, and going on a color run. Um, amusement parks, I think Universal's opening, not like I would go down there, but I think that might just be a good model for amusement parks around here. Um, I just don't know if it's the best idea to go, even if they are open. Um, also go to see live music. I think that one is a bit more possible, but it really depends on, like, I don't know, everything really. Also going surfing, um, I don't have a surfboard, so we'd kind of have to be in Puerto Rico to do this one. So I don't know if we're going to get down there, that's why it's not very possible. Also going on a color run, um, I know the color run in Boston was cancelled, so I'm not sure if there are going to be any other ones, so I might just post this, postpone this one to next year, but I still want to do it someday. So yeah, I think that's it. Make sure you guys check out all of my summer bucket list videos from last year if you haven't already seen them. Um, and I'm really excited to get started with this series, and I hope you guys are too. So I guess I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!